As we turn our gaze toward Mercury, we see it slowly catching up to Earth on one side of the Sun, moving against the distant backdrop of stars. The planet seems to reverse direction, appearing to move backwards through the night sky, a phenomenon known as retrograde motion. This optical illusion has long captivated humanity, but Mercury itself, the smallest and closest planet to the Sun, has remained one of the most elusive and mysterious worlds in our solar system. While Venus, Mars, and even distant Jupiter have garnered our attention, Mercury has been largely overlooked, hidden in the blinding shadow of the Sun. Its scorching temperatures, relentless radiation, and hostile conditions have made it one of the most difficult planets to study. But recently, that all changed. What was once a barren, lifeless world, so hot it could melt lead, has now revealed itself to be far more complex, enigmatic, and even terrifying than we ever imagined. Thanks to the European Space Agency's Bepi Colombo mission, humanity has finally been able to capture high-resolution images of Mercury, images that have shattered everything we thought we knew about this tiny, mysterious planet. What they discovered is not just unexpected, it's downright astonishing. Unveiling Mercury, a world of surprises for decades, scientists have considered Mercury a barren wasteland, a planet scorched by the relentless heat of the sun, its surface a pockmarked collection of craters and ancient volcanic plains. With no atmosphere to protect it, the planet has been constantly bombarded by meteoroids for billions of years, leaving behind a surface that seemed as unremarkable as it was inhospitable. What more could there possibly be to discover about a planet so close to the Sun that even the toughest spacecraft would be tested to survive its brutal conditions? As it turns out, a lot. The Bepi Colombo mission, a glimpse into Mercury's secrets launched in 2018, Bepi Colombo was specifically designed to survive in Mercury's extreme environment. After years of intricate orbital maneuvers, it finally reached Mercury in 2021, providing us with humanity's first detailed look at the planet. The images captured by the spacecraft were nothing short of revolutionary. They showed us a planet not just covered in craters, but a world that is actively reshaping itself, far more dynamic than we ever thought possible. One of the most significant findings was the sheer number of craters pockmarking Mercury's surface. While this wasn't surprising, after all, the planet has no atmosphere to shield it from meteoroid impacts, what was remarkable was the presence of unusual reflective halos around many of these craters. These halos initially confused scientists. At first, it seemed almost absurd to think that ice could exist on Mercury, a planet that experiences temperatures hot enough to melt lead. And yet, when scientists took a closer look, they discovered something far stranger than ice. The reflective material around the craters wasn't water ice at all, it was a completely unknown mineral, one that doesn't exist anywhere else in the solar system. This discovery is profound for a number of reasons. Not only does it raise questions about how this material could have survived on a planet so close to the Sun, but it challenges everything we thought we knew about the durability of minerals under extreme conditions. Some researchers believe this strange compound might have been delivered by ancient comets, while others speculate that it could be the result of entirely unknown geological processes. Whatever the cause, this finding suggests that Mercury is far more complex than we ever imagined. The enigma of the Caloris Basin, geometric patterns on Mercury's surface but Bepi Colombo didn't stop there. As it continued its survey of Mercury, the spacecraft made even more baffling discoveries. In the Caloris Basin, one of Mercury's most striking features, scientists observed vast cliffs and ridges stretching hundreds of kilometers. These cliffs were formed as Mercury's crust contracted and cooled billions of years ago. But hidden within these cliffs were features that immediately caught scientists off guard, strange, geometric patterns that appeared to form grids, straight lines, sharp angles, almost like something artificially constructed. At first, the scientific community dismissed these patterns as natural formations, 
the result of tectonic forces and the planet's slow geological evolution. But as more images came in, the regularity of these formations became too difficult to ignore. Could these patterns be something more? Could they be evidence of an ancient civilization that once inhabited Mercury, an advanced society capable of shaping the very landscape itself? While this idea might seem far-fetched, it's not entirely out of the realm of possibility. After all, similar geometric patterns have been observed on Mars and the Moon. Could it be that our solar system was once home to multiple civilizations, spread across different worlds? This theory may seem speculative, but it forces us to confront some profound questions. What if Mercury was once home to a thriving civilization? What if the surface we see today is the result of millennia of erosion and neglect, leaving behind only traces of a lost history? If this is true, it would fundamentally change our understanding of life in the universe and our place within it. Mercury's magnetic anomalies, signs of alien technology. Perhaps one of the most perplexing discoveries came when Bepi Colombo detected strange magnetic anomalies on Mercury's surface. The planet's magnetic field is already a mystery. Unlike Earth, which has a strong magnetic field generated by a liquid core, Mercury's magnetic field is weak and unstable, puzzling for a planet of its size. Yet, the spacecraft detected localized hot spots of intense magnetic activity on Mercury's surface, creating patterns that defy current scientific explanations. These anomalies raise some chilling possibilities. Could they be evidence of an ancient, forgotten technology? Some scientists have speculated that Mercury's magnetic hotspots might be the remnants of an artificial magnetic field, engineered by a civilization long gone. On Earth, we use magnetic fields for everything from energy generation to data storage. Could Mercury's magnetic anomalies be signs of such advanced technology, designed for purposes we can't even fathom? Water vapor on Mercury, a surprising discovery adding another layer to the mystery, Bepi Colombo also detected faint traces of water vapor in Mercury's exosphere. Given Mercury's proximity to the Sun, scientists had long believed that liquid water could never exist on the planet. The surface is too hot, and the planet's gravity too weak to retain water vapor for long. Yet, there it is, a faint veil of water vapor, hanging in the planet's tenuous atmosphere. Scientists believe the water vapor might be escaping from ice deposits hidden in permanently shadowed craters near Mercury's poles. These craters, which never see the sun, are cold enough to preserve ice for billions of years. But the real question is, where did this ice come from? Was it deposited by ancient comets? or could it be a remnant of an ancient ocean that once covered the planet's surface? The idea that Mercury could have once had liquid water, and even conditions suitable for life, is a mind-boggling revelation that challenges everything we thought we knew about this scorching planet. Underground tunnels, is there life beneath the surface? One of the most unsettling discoveries came from Bepi Colombo's imaging techniques, which revealed vast underground cavities and tunnels stretching for hundreds of kilometers beneath Mercury's surface. These tunnels, some connected by intricate networks, appear far too regular to be the result of volcanic activity alone. The sheer scale and precision of these formations have led some scientists to speculate that these tunnels might not be natural at all. Could they be the remnants of an artificial structure? If so, what was their purpose? Even more intriguing is the possibility that these tunnels could harbor some form of life, perhaps microbial organisms that survived in Mercury's underground chambers, shielded from the brutal radiation and heat above. After all, extremophiles microbes that thrive in extreme conditions, exist here on Earth. Could Mercury, once home to a thriving ecosystem, still harbor hidden life beneath its surface? Mercury's geological secrets, active and changing even more surprising is the evidence of ongoing geological activity on Mercury. 
Recent findings suggest that Mercury's interior may still be active, with the planet's core slowly contracting and shifting. Scientists have detected seismic activity, Mercury quakes, that suggests the planet's crust is still in motion. And these quakes are not random, they appear to cluster around specific regions that coincide with the magnetic anomalies and geometric formations previously detected. This raises some chilling possibilities, could Mercury's underground tunnels and voids still be active, their networks shifting and evolving even today? And if so, what impact could this have on the rest of the solar system? Mercury, the closest planet to the Sun, plays a unique and vital role in the delicate balance of the inner solar system. Any significant geological event, such as a massive underground collapse or volcanic eruption, could send shockwaves through the entire solar system, potentially altering the orbits and dynamics of the other inner planets, including Earth. Conclusion, rethinking our understanding of the solar system the revelations coming from Bepi Colombo have forced scientists to rethink everything they thought they knew about Mercury, and perhaps even the nature of planetary evolution. If Mercury can maintain geological activity under such extreme conditions, what does that mean for other seemingly lifeless planets?